Hello guys, for this tonight video, I will just give you an evaluation of a company <clears throat> and uh, this company is most known for ketchup you know, when you go to uh, fast food like McDonald's or other, um, or other uh, fast food uh, stores uh, the thing that that comes to you to your mind when you have a uh, uh, french fries you think about ketchup okay this company makes ketchup and makes a lot of things now understand that my evaluation is always about the price and understand that uh warren buffett i think he owns uh, he owns part of this uh, company but understand that we we are looking always for um a price okay and how uh, we see the price okay so stay tuned hello guys again my name is Abdelkarim Marmain I am your trainer and coach and for today's video we try to see a company that it is very famous of ketchup it means when you go to uh, fast food stores like mcdonald's or or uh, burger king or any other uh, stores here in america you will find that when you buy a uh, french fries they give you always uh, this ketchup and uh, another th information that i should uh, tell you is that uh, this company is <clears throat> owned part of it by warren buffett Okay, it is one of his uh, stocks. Understand that Warren Buffett he likes he likes companies with a unique product. This is uh, th this thing he he does uh, he did fifty or sixty years ago. He's always looking for companies like this. Okay, so let's go now to the chart and check what's going on. Okay, as you can see the chart here. <clears throat> Now the stock was the high uh, here. It was forty-eight dollars sixty-six cents. I think after the uh, the earning news from forty forty-eight sixty-six, it goes to thirty-four, which is a big a big gap up. Understand forty-eight to. 34 okay so uh, it's like uh, <clears throat> 12 dollars 12 dollars it means it's going to be like uh, uh, like around the 25 percent okay and it is too much now here i will show you please uh, stay until the end of this video i will show you how uh, to see the stocks after uh, after the earnings now so as you can see KHC it is not just this gap down that it is most uh, significant understand that this stock was going down so bad you see it was here for example 93 dollars in uh, June 5, 2017. Okay, it means after nearly two years, the stock was 93, now it is 33. What does it mean? It means in two years, it lost around 66% of its worth. So this company, as I see, it looks like it has some problems. Okay, and the gap down, this gap down was so big at the end. You can see it was so big. Now, so for me, even if I don't go to the fundamentals, I understand that this company has a problem. Okay, it could be any kind of problem. Okay, so if you are looking to search deeply what's going on to this company, you can search and see. Now, for, for us, if, for example, if you own this company, I don't know, maybe, 
uh, and you think and you see that it is losing a lot of money, it's high time to see something. Now, I will give you a way to check this. The high of the gap down is 36. Okay, you put 36 here. And then you do what? Just you give it a color like blue, for example. Now, try to see where the stock in these few uh, weeks have gone down. Okay, so let's see. I see this one, uh, 3160, 3165, 3153. Okay, this I think is the lowest. 3153. Now, 3153. This is the low. You can put it in red. Now, if you you own this company let's say you see it going down and you buy it I understand some people they just do uh, whatever so if the stock crosses the line it might be a buy in the future now what is the other possible thing if the stock in the future crosses the support line it might be a very bad idea to stay in this stock okay don't listen to anyone online either uh, either like uh, websites or uh, or um, or tv shows or whatever oh this is the best company in the world just hold it it will go up okay you will never know so for us we see the price the price doesn't lie okay and understand that see after this gap up it can have another gap a gap down uh, after this gap down it can have another gap down and this company uh, will collapse now um this uh, khc it remembers me of uh, ge before when it was 32 and then it goes to 16. so we covered that last year so this company i see is doing bad right now for two years okay it's not it's not from this gap down it's it's a long time and for me i don't need to see the fundamentals to see the problem khc has a problem it's fundamental problem maybe debt maybe uh doesn't sell well uh, whatever uh, question whatever thing is okay so guys you try always when you hold a stock for a long time whatever is this stock whatever they say to you whatever it is known about this stock try not to believe anyone try to see the price and make a decision okay so thank you very much guys please subscribe to my channel and ring the bell if you don't and see you tomorrow for another video